Welcome to another video of Snipe IT. In today's video, I'll show you how we can add the custom fields into Snipe IT. So if you hover over to this particular section here, you will see custom fields here in the settings. And here is custom fields. So you will be landing into this page. So this particular page shows you the custom fields that you can add and you can also have the field sets. So before I show you field sets, let me show you how we can add the custom fields. So I can add a new custom field, for example, custom field could be anything uh like uh, processor generation and here is yeah, this will be text box format is enter the generation of the processor so you can see here i have added all the custom fields here processor mac address ram uh, hard disks and uh, operating system imei make here so you can add any specification that you think will be required for your asset so these can be added as, as custom fields into your assets and let me show you what are the field sets so field fed sets are associated with any of the asset model and you can group multiple fields for that specific asset group now for example if i go here new field set uh, so here on the right side you can see here new field set if i click here new field set so you will see that i can add the name of new field set it will i will name it for example fields for macbook pro and here i'll save it or even i can name it let me name it in a proper way i'll say here fields for pc which will be either for laptop or desktop and i'll save it so what is required here for example i need to enter the processor this is required field save and then next field i need is the ram and it is required field save then is the hard disk required field save and then is uh, the operating system maybe maybe it is not a required field so we can still capture the field and finally maybe processor generation and i'll order it with the processor number two and save it now you can see here processor and processor this one i'll bring down All right, so processor, processor generation, RAM, hard disk, and operating system. These are all the required fields for any of the model of laptop that I want to add. Now, for example, if I go and click here, save. All right, so this has been created now. If you see here, fields for PC and laptop, there are five fields added. If I click here, I can see what all fields are required as a custom field into this particular field set. Now I want to associate this field set with the specific model. So I will go here to asset models and these are all the asset models. For example, I want to link it from here. So this is the model. I'll click here and you will see here on the right side. Uh, these are all the models which are available. So I'll just click on the edit option here. The moment you edit here, you will see that you can choose the custom field also here so these are all the custom field sets so i'll choose fields for laptops and desktop and save here now you can see here any laptop or desktop that is part of this particular asset it will have all the custom fields available you can see here processor processor generation ram hard disk operating system so these will be the custom fields which will be available for this particular model so field sets are relevant to the models of the assets so you can go here to field set custom fields create the custom fields then create the field sets and then link it with the asset models so hope you like this video see you in next video take care and goodbye